Yo, so if you want to get better at spin moves with the basketball, you should consider getting good and better at spin moves without the basketball. Um, I think it's a mistake to only train movements with the ball, and it helps a lot if you try to target the athletic movement itself in other ways and then come and add it in with the basketball later or without a ball because um, spinning uh, is a good way to move without the ball as well, going around screens, for instance. So um, I encourage you to practice spinning without the basketball on various surfaces, uh, barefoot or with shoes. You could practice with a punching bag, as I'm doing here, or you could practice with another person, or you could just use your imagination. But it helps to have physical objects, so you can sense the physics of what it feels like to move around the bag or move around the object, what amount of force to apply, how to, how to press with your shoulders or your hands, and so forth. But bottom line is, if you want to get better at spin moves in basketball, get better better at spin moves in general. Um, focus on the actual athletic movement itself and you come back and add it with the ball and you'll have amazing gains so hope this helps if it does uh, let me know in the comments or whatever you can always reach me and happy training everybody peace